Getty UK academics have been accused of supporting Syria and Russia The senior lecturers, based at Edinburgh, Sheffield, and Leicester, have formed a group called Syria, Propaganda, and Media, SPM, which spreads disinformation about the events occurring in the war-torn Middle East country. A chemical attack on civilians is believed to have taken place in Syria last weekend, with the West attributing blame at President Assad and Russia. However, yesterday one member of the SPM, Tim Hayward, a professor of environmental political theory at the University of Edinburgh used Twitter to promote a claim white helmets and terrorist factions staged false flag events and kidnapped, drugged children to use as props in events. The esteemed professor used the social media site to share a blog by one of his colleagues which argued there was evidence of the Syria president or his allies carrying out an attack. He also used the hashtag hash Syria hoax when referring to the incident. In another tweet he said, White Helmet's mission, to save one headscarf is to save all hash Syria hoax. The tweet has since been deleted. The claims support a Russian narrative surrounding the attack. With both Putin and Assad denying an attack ever took place, Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov said in a press conference on Friday, We have irrefutable evidence that this was yet another performance and that security services of a country which is trying to be in the front lines of the Russophobic campaign were involved in this performance. He announced that Russian experts had examined the site of the alleged attack in the city, and found no trace of chemical weapons, defending his tweet. Professor Robinson told The Times, I understood a hashtag to indicate a topic rather than a creed. I do not accept that I am spreading any disinformation. Get a Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov has denied any chemical attack took place The professor has also been defended by the University of Edinburgh, who said, We, recognize and uphold the fundamental importance of freedom of expression and seek to foster a culture that enables it to take place within a framework of mutual respect. Another professor in the SPM, Piers Robinson from Sheffield University, gave his support to the findings of Vanessa Bile, a pro-Assad journalist in Syria. He said, she produces information that is worthy of consideration and certainly her work on the White Helmets along with work produced by others, raises extremely important questions for academics to research, the public to know about, and is rightly worthy of consideration. The US, UK and France are expected to take military action in Syria this weekend in response to the chemical attack.